just pulled the block out and as you can see all the rust right there is pretty much gone still kind of thick there's still some under it close this door all the way and if we look through the holes you see that's probably where the die anode was at more so than this one or this one so what we're probably going to end up doing is tossing it back in there with all three anodes on this side but it's for the outside of the block We've got a lot of fucking surface rust on the outside out especially on this side for some reason it's like no rust there and in my last video you can see that it was pretty rusted but uh the whole line of sight deal plays into this because you can see it at the bottom still rust so I was going to start scrubbing this down but if we're not going to get the desired results we're not going to scrub it down I have a nylon brush around here that I can't find okay you know what? I don't want to use one of my greasy ass brass ones see if we can't find that nylon one oh, oh, oh. Oh, that's brass Eh, you know what? Just wash it off. Wash off some of the grease. Try to do a good job rinsing that grease off. And give it a light scrub right now. You don't really have to use a brass brush for this. I'm just doing it because I'm paranoid. And I'm gonna destroy something. Mostly I'm just adding grease to it with this though, so you know we may have to wait until we get the damn brush that I was talking about before yeah but unless that crap's just brushing right off you actually see it brushing off to reveal like a more uniform casting it's not all over the place Let's see it coming off and Talking kind of quiet right now because my neighbors are out fixing their fence and I don't want to seem like a lunatic. Kind of late for that though, pretty sure. Yeah, it's still pretty damn rusty on this side. I think we need a better anode on this side. So, what we're going to do is put it right back in there. And that's probably exactly what we're going to do. This is just warm, soapy water. I think we're gonna put it right back in there with uh, three anodes on one side so I can get the cylinders out a little bit better. The cylinders clean a little bit better. Oh, oh god, it almost got stuck in there. So I put it right back in. Yeah, you know what? That ain't gonna work. Yeah, that shit's definitely coming off now. You can even see it coming off. But I'm thinking she needs to go back in for another couple of hours at least to get most of the surface crap off. Still got a rusty tinge to it. Yeah, and even the top has a rusty tinge to it because of all the rust that was taken off of it. And this had a lot of rust. Like earlier, I didn't videotape it, but all of these things you can actually see like little peaks of rust in there and they're kind of knocked down pretty good so I think we're just gonna throw her back in there for maybe another couple of hours see if we can get some better results I think we're gonna put three anodes on one side and see if we can't put one in front of each hole so that way they kind of cross over a little bit the animals look nasty too. They look really nasty. I'll show you guys that in a bit though. 